Alright guys, what's going on? It's Bliss Tech here, bringing you another video. Today's video is going to be about speeding up Windows 10. So first things first, let's get straight into it. What I want you to do is go to your start menu and I want you to click on these start programs that are pinned to your start bar. I want you to right click on them and click unpin from start on every single one of them. Just make sure you don't double, double left click them or else they're going to open. So I just want you to do that, basically, and that's what now your start menu will look like. It's a lot cleaner and it's a lot faster. Now what I would like you to do is I would like you to right click on your um, desktop and click personalise. Then from here, I need to go to background and basically from here, if your laptop is, um, hasn't got a good amount of RAM, then or computer or whatever you're using, I want you to go to picture and I want you to click solid colour and I want you to change it to a colour of your choice. This will make it run a lot faster. And also, I would like you to go to start menu, and I want you to go down, and I want you to turn all of these off. So, occasionally you show suggestions in start, I want you to turn that off. Show more, show the most used apps, I want you to turn that off. Show recently added apps, turn that off. And then, show recently opened items in jump list on start or taskbar, turn that off as well. And then, also what you can do from here, I think that's it actually, yep. You can change the colour, but that's not really necessary to be, to be honest. And yeah, that's that's that. Now, when you exit off that, and now this is what it'll look like. It's pretty straightforward, really. But this is what it'll look like once you've done it. It's a lot cleaner and just a lot faster. Now, I want you to go down to here, and I want you to type in system. I want you to click this one. I want you to go to advanced system settings, and then go along to system protection, and to be honest, if you don't want to do this, then that's fine, but it will make a big difference to how Windows 10 performs. So when you click this, and then if yours is on, on, then now when you've got configure, uh, configure, and now when you disable it, and then click apply, then click OK. And then also, in this tab here, you want to go to remote, and if you are allow remote assistance co connections to this computer, I want you to turn that off, because why would you want like other people and all that connecting to your computer, you don't want that to happen. Now exit off of that, and when you to exit off of this, now I want you to go down here and go to settings. Now when you to click on system, now here is where it all happens basically. I want you to go to display first, and basically I just want you to turn your brightness down a little bit. That'll help. And then I want you to go to notifications and actions, and basically why would you want tips about Windows, so turn that off. I just like to turn everything off apart from show app notifications because like if an app is running and I get a notification on it, obviously I want to be able to see what that notification is. And then apps and fe features, this will take a while to hold up. On apps and features, I just want you to basically, you can uninstall stuff that you don't really use. For example, BT Locker, I don't really know what that is, so I probably will uninstall that. Like Matt Vast, obviously I'm, I'm going to keep that on. Uh, there's, you can just only install a load of things, like I'm never going to play Microsoft Solitaire, to be honest, I'm never going to play that, so I probably will un uninstall that too. But there's some things that I use, so I'm going to keep on them on there. Then multitasking, I just like to keep that on. Tablet mode, I turn that off because I, really, I don't really want that on, to be honest. So, turn that off. Battery saver, I keep that on. Power and sleep, it's up to you what you're doing here, but on here, put them both to never. Then storage, I just leave that as it is. Offline maps, you, why would you need maps on your laptop or your PC? So I turn them off. Then default apps. Then in here is just where you choose all your default apps. So don't worry about that. And then that's just about your laptop or your computer. Sorry, I keep saying laptop. It's because I'm on a laptop. So that's that done. And basically, that is basically how to make it a f bit faster. Then also you can go down here onto your taskbar, this is just to make it look a bit cleaner. And then from here I just want you to go on properties. Uh, I want you to go to taskbar buttons and click never combine. This basically, what watch down here like how the two separate two separate like uh, taskbars. If I click on um, always combine or always combine, let's for example, and click apply. It like, it makes them like, so I can't see what they say. And then if I click combine when taskbar is full, it does that, and but like it's, that's basically the same as what I had it on. So I just like to click never combine, it makes it look a bit cleaner. So yeah guys, that is basically how to make your PC and Windows 10 a lot faster. Thank you for watching.
please subscribe if you haven't already please like and please comment and please share my channel around as i do upload daily so thank you for watching and i'm out bye